and axes on the cross arm at the top. And uh, while they were working there, they just went up and they unhooked my antenna and carefully coiled it up and just placed it inside my front fence. And when they'd finished, uh, even without being asked, they just went across and picked it up and unwound it, climbed up the ladder and hooked it back on the hook. So I had my 160-meter dipole. I don't think you'd get that sort of treatment these days, Bill. Over. All right. Yeah, well, there's another station, uh, Bill. It might be Doug to come back for another try. So I'll just uh, stand by, Bill. I'll see who it is. QRZ. Now this is VK4 Juliet Romeo Charlie VK4 JRC over. Okay, VK4 JRC. This is Jeff VK4 GJP. Go ahead. Yeah, okay, Jeff. Uh, yeah, good evening to the group there. The name here is Jack Juliet Alpha Charlie Kilo, and uh, I'm located about 30 kilometres uh, south of Rockhampton, out in the bush here. I've actually. Uh, Brought my radio out tonight to uh, have a bit of a play in the bush at the farm shed. And this is my first contact on 160 metres. And I've had a licence for, I don't know, 25 years or something. But anyway, um, I hooked up my uh, my Helicraft KX3 tonight to a one kilometre long loop. Which is fed with a uh, four to one ballon and ladder line. And I'm getting uh, signals here from you guys of about 5 and 9 plus. So, a uh, very good copy this evening. Uh, back to you, Jeff. Over. Oh, excellent, Jack. I'm really pleased that you can hear, hear Bill because he's out at uh, Carnarvon Station, west of the Carnarvon uh, National Park there, the Carnarvon Gorge and that. So, I'm real glad you can hear Bill. And welcome to Top Band. <laughs> It's, uh, it's certainly, um, although I've had, I have operated on 160 metres right through the summer, most most winters I spend most, if I'm in the shack on a winter's evening, uh, that's any time from now until the storm start in spring, I'm usually found skulking around uh, top band, so um, that's excellent. I'm very pleased to be your first contact uh, on 160 Jack, and I hope there are many more. Now you might have heard my comments saying there's a fair bit of activity uh, before sunrise on this band, 1859 and other places. But if you, if you really want to hear some big strong signals on 160, it'll mean, pardon me, dragging yourself out of bed early. So there you are, Bill. There's a gentleman called Jack up at Rockhampton. He's hearing you just fine, so I'll put it across to you, Bill, to call Jack in. BK4, GJC, over. Yeah, uh, BK4, JRC, Jack, this is BK4. Juliet, Whiskey, I've got a bit of copy on you, mate. Uh, I'm only working, mate, a while, so it's uh, just to make the contact, over. Yeah, OK, Bill. I uh, did miss part of your call sign, BK4, JRC, returning. You're about in five and five, but it's fairly noisy here. And that's not bad considering uh, you're running off a mobile. Um, quite good. Yeah, this is my first experience on 160 metres. So um, I thought I'd give a call out tonight and uh, see how it went. And actually, I just came down here to check the loop for tuning and heard you all talking there. So I thought, oh, I better see if I can make a contact. The radio's only putting out 10 watts. I'm only running 10 watts from the Ellicraft KX3 radio. So... Yeah, not a whole lot of power there, uh, Bill. Now, um, your call sign, VK4, question mark, India Whiskey, I think. Uh, back to you, VK4JRC. Yeah, VK4 Whiskey, Juliet Whiskey. Yeah, that's right, Bill. Uh, I'm just going to have a look at the radio again. Okay, VK4 Whiskey, Juliet Whiskey. Okay, got it, Bill. Uh, no problem that time. As I said, bit of noise here tonight, but... Um, yeah, thought we'd give it a go and see if we could call in. Thanks for uh, allowing me to uh, come in. Your signal, as I said before, is about a 5 and 5, and Jeff's about a 5 and 9. So, uh, yeah, not doing too badly at all there. And it's uh, 
testing out my aerial on this end too, which I wasn't sure how well it would work on this band there. Uh, back to you, uh, Bill. Uh, Bill, uh, Jeff here. Just, um, if you don't, guys don't mind having a chat with one another, and I'll be back in a few minutes. You remember I said I had, had to make a phone call. <clears throat> so, I'll leave it with you, Jack. I'll turn the volume down. I'll rejoin you as soon as I finish with this phone call. Over.